open box, opening box, box opening without the box opening. Protec, super hauler bag. Uh, I'm gonna build a little bit of it for you. Uh, I picked this up at Never Enough RC. Uh, Justin, thank you. I've been really needing to get out to his shop and just haven't done it. So, had the opportunity on Saturday and uh, picked up this. So, here we go. So, you gotta build it a little bit. And um, so, it has drawers. I'm not sure if you know. It says to pre bend them, so we're gonna pre bend them up. Double-sided tape. So we'll peel these two outside ones off first. Bend them down and in, and then we just bring this up. Line it up. Stick it and stick it. Flip to the other side. We'll take the both outside ones off again. Outside and outside. Fold them in. Fold it up. So that's all you got to do for that. And then they have rails, which also holds all this shut. So that's what the other double sided tape is. So peel both these off. And I just start on one side. Like so. And then uh, we'll just do the other side. you build a box. They actually are really rigid once you get those rails on. Uh, we'll build one more and then show you the rest of it. There you go, that's the main car one. Here it is, all in of its glory. They give you this little top tray. That one doesn't have any double-sided tape. That one just slides in. You got a bunch of tool room up top and back here. So we can flip this up. We got five drawers that we can put in it. These, when it comes, it, they come out and then these side supports are in here as well and it is all collapsed down. You open it up, put this vertical structure in here. This one's notched out for the roller wheels and this one goes up front without the notches. We got Velcro here and in the back and on the side. And then we got the support in the center. Two levels there. We have a big bag out back on actually the side end. We have a real big one on the back. Two 
two one on the front, and it also has an extending pull handle, so you can roll it wherever you need. It does have one little one that goes on the wheel side. Also zips down so you don't have to rely on just Velcro. Um, so there it is. I'll keep you guys updated. I'm gonna use it for a little bit and give you an honest review after that. Got a carrying strap. 